Dang. That victory Easter play, though, was really good. The quality was amazing. Um, I have a few things here and there only because I'm just a critic at heart. But overall, it was a fantastic play, beautifully done, beautifully created, and the message was obviously very straightforward and portrayed very well. Good job, Victory. I approve. I have to say, though, I really love the scene where they just dumped all this, like, fake blood on the actor during the crucifixion scene. And the reason I really like that is because it's so accurate to what actually happened. Jesus was tortured. I mean, he was so bloody beyond recognition of being a man. That's what scripture says. It makes you remember um, that God himself came into human flesh, the, the same human flesh that feels pain and fear and just humiliation beyond recognition. This is what Jesus went through in order for me and you and the whole world to be connected with God again. The very foundation of my faith is set in that belief that God loves the world so much that he did that that he gave his one and only son to die for our sins. And not just die, I mean be tortured on behalf of all humankind. You know, and that's just so powerful to me that you loved me that much. You loved us that much to do that. It's just, it's powerful. That's where my faith lies. And what's even better is my salvation is not about following rules or regulation or what religion has set up for me. That's not it at all. It has everything to do with the fact that I just simply, truly believe that Jesus Christ was a son of God and he came down and died for my sins. That is the foundation of my faith. That is the reason for my salvation. That is the reason I live the life that I do today because of that. Nothing else. So, with all that, happy Easter, happy Resurrection Sunday, however you want to say it. I'm praying for you guys and I'm praying that no matter where you are in your life, that Jesus reveals himself to you in an undeniable way that you cannot ignore because he loves you guys so much. And I'm praying that you guys have a fantastic Sunday and a great week. Wow, that was really corny, <laughs> but nonetheless true.